A growing number of political analysts argue that President Joe Biden may be deliberately undermining Vice President Kamala Harris's presidential campaign after being pressured to drop his re-election bid due to concerns about his cognitive abilities. Motorola Razr 50 Ultra flipped the script. Hello, Moto. Since stepping aside in July, Biden has been notably absent from Harris's campaign trail, offering little beyond an endorsement, while reportedly overshadowing her on key occasions. In one instance, Biden held his own briefing on Hurricane Helene, despite Harris cancelling a campaign event to manage the storm response. Some critics see this as a pattern of behaviour, suggesting Biden's reluctance to fully back Harris. Tensions between their camps have been rising, as Harris is forced to navigate loyalty to Biden's unpopular administration while promoting herself as an agent of change. Republican strategist Jason Meister described Biden's actions as a form of revenge. Biden is intentionally enacting revenge on Kamala for knifing him in the back. He never liked her. The happiest he's looked in four years was when he put a red hat on after speaking with Shankstill firefighters last month on September 11. He should just come out and endorse Trump. Biden's allies, however, dismiss these claims, stating that Biden has consistently backed Harris and remains committed to the administration's shared vision. Still, some Democratic insiders speculate Biden's subtle distancing from Harris is a power play to maintain influence and remind voters who's still in charge. Harris's presidency would likely maintain much of the progressive agenda set by the Biden administration, particularly in areas such as healthcare, climate action, and racial justice. However, Harris has indicated that she would take a more proactive stance on issues like criminal justice reform and voting rights, areas where Biden has faced criticism for not moving fast enough. Harris might also be more assertive in addressing police reform, given her background as a former prosecutor and California Attorney General. Her administration could be marked by a stronger focus on social justice issues compared to Biden's more centrist tendencies. In contrast to Biden's more moderate approach, Harris may adopt a bolder tone on economic policies, such as student loan forgiveness, expanding Medicare, and addressing wealth inequality. In terms of policy and leadership style, Harris would likely offer a more assertive and progressive platform compared to Biden's moderate and compromise-driven approach. This could excite the Democratic base, but also potentially deepen divisions within the party, as she'll need to address the varied interests of its different factions. Amid these rising tensions, Harris continues to struggle on the campaign trail while Trump supporters and political commentators relish the internal drama.